Pamela Jean Noble is a model, actress, and fitness influencer. Millions of people follow her on social media, and she's currently developing a merchandise store. Pamela joins us now in studio to talk about the business of fitness. Pamela, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Yes, last time we talked with you, you were on Skype, mm -hmm. so we're so happy to have you yes. in studio. Um, a always, lot more fun. Always more fun. <laughs> There's a lot going on. Welcome to our studio. Um, okay, so you've created this fitness empire online. We want to talk about how did you start this? Oh, geez. Um, I started, well, at first I wasn't in fitness at all. Um, mm -hmm. I modeled for Tap Out and Solin and a lot of action sports companies. Mm -hmm. So it just kind of transferred into fitness. You know, I was like 23 and I was like, okay, well, I can't model forever. Mm -hmm. What can I do forever? Well, so that wasn't fitness modeling for tap out or anything? No, no okay. not at all. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, the fitness empire was booming at that time. I always liked working out mm -hmm. and um, yeah, I just decided, okay, well, let's compete. Let's figure out how I can get this going. And here I am, mm -hmm. 28 years old, <laughs> still doing it. That's really young. <laughs> yeah. Well, I know, but like for a model, years, oh, yeah. Yeah. one of those things. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you have to like, you have to figure out, you know, how you can keep it alive and mm -hmm. use it to your advantage. Definitely. And so. so you've done that by now monetizing your business. I have been mm -hmm. trying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you have a huge presence on social media. You have like 330,000 fan or Instagram followers, mm -hmm. uh, your fans. So a lot us, on Facebook yeah. too. Yeah, I'm about um, to get 4 million. I'm really excited. Yeah. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> yeah. So tell us what is your favorite platform for kind of promoting yourself and you also um, work with a lot of different products and brands. Yeah, I mean, I do love Facebook just because I feel like there's still the most followers out mm -hmm. there on mm -hmm. it and there's so many more things you can do with it than just put a picture in a video. Like yeah. this, I could put, you know, just a post about mm -hmm. come and watching. Mm -hmm. Um, but I do love the fun of Instagram because it's quick to see people's yeah. things and kind of go through. So I like both of them, mm -hmm. but yeah, it's been crazy the past mm -hmm. few years working with all these companies and getting to mm -hmm. do things from like putting stuff in my house to fitness wear to, I mean, the clothes I'm mm -hmm. wearing today, it's crazy. You look fab. Yes. <laughs> so before you, so we're going to get into you, obviously you're launching all of your own products, but before that, so how would you decide whether you want to endorse something mm -hmm. and like, what are the things you would take into consideration? So I think a, for building your platform, you can't, it's not just being a pretty face. Like it is like a business and you sure. treat it like being mm -hmm. a business. If you think that just because you're beautiful, you're going to get all these followers. It's like not how it works at all. Mm -hmm. Um, but I worked every day at it. Every product that I endorsed, I really decided I loved it, whether it was a supplement or hair products that I use. A lot of the companies I work with, like Hospitality Skin Spa is one of my big sponsors. I already went to them. And you then, have great skin. Thank you. So <laughs> it's working. That's because of them. Yeah. And then um, like I have a lash company and mm -hmm. I've been with her since like the very beginning. She used to be my makeup artist. She started a lash company. Oh. And I, so I really like supporting um, people that I either really love their products or I already supported them and then they kind of turned it into a business. Mm -hmm. So, okay, yeah. very cool. When it comes to your business, what is your typical day like? How do you, oh, how, for a social media <laughs> influencer, I've always been kind of curious how mm -hmm. you well, lay out your day. I feel like mine's a little bit different because I don't just do that. Right, a lot right. of people, it's like all they do is influencing. So mm -hmm. I could have a photo shoot one day, the next day, tell my boyfriend I need to get a billion <laughs> pictures and Tons of products. Is he, does he take the photos? Yeah. He's the Instagram boyfriend. <laughs> oh, your Instagram oh. boyfriend? Oh. <laughs> and then, um, and then the next day I could be on a TV set. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of all over the place. Thank God, all my family, friends, and he puts up with me because I literally work 24 seven, whether mm -hmm. it's a weekday or sometimes I've had to be on set at 3 AM for uh -huh. like a TV show. So it's crazy, but wow. I love it. It's awesome. Okay, so let's talk about the new merchandise store that's yeah. opening soon. Is this so? Is this gonna be on your website, or where is this going to live? It's gonna it's be launching. separate. I'm sure I'll have okay. like a link on my website. Okay. Um, it's kind of separate. I've always wanted to do something, but it's really hard to like put all your time and effort into that when you're already yeah when you're spread that apart. busy. Yeah, mm -hmm. so um, I'm really excited about it. We're gonna have um, like a little bit of everything from like t-shirts, calendars to like signed pictures. So it should be really fun once it gets started. So are you going to ever do like fitness DVDs or supplements or like... I have so many people wanting me to do yeah, that. Yeah, can you show us some boot? I'm kidding. <laughs> you don't have to show us now. You look She's great. Like, you you see see like, not in your heels. No, yeah. but I wanted, you know, some of these moves. We would love to get a DVD Yeah, from DVD you. would be awesome. So I think... 
I have like the easy way. Um, I'm a fitness girl sponsored athlete. They're like a really big magazine. We've had them on the show a yes. couple times. We love fitness yeah, girls. Yeah, they're awesome. So they're trying to start um, something on their website where each fitness girl will kind of have their own workout slash um, diet routine. Mm -hmm. So I'm really excited about that because that kind of gives it where it's like, hey, it's under your control, but I'll give you the content. Mm -hmm. So I don't have to like kind of keep up with it. Yeah. But it's a great way too because fitness girls, everybody loves that platform. Mm -hmm. So I think... With doing it with them, it's going to be even better than probably something I could come up with. Well, it's always good to have more like people making a better yeah. product at the end of the day. Like two heads are better than one. Exactly. Or are better than well, one. and then it's one of those things like let's do the tapes, and then okay, now you figure out what to do with them. Exactly. <laughs> like let them work on that. Okay, so we want to talk about supplements yes. also. Okay. Um, a lot of us get like lost. There's so many things out there. There's so many people many. Are promoting different yeah. things. Like. Give us some recommendations that are good for like everyone and like what your favorite go-tos are. Okay, so I also heard that you guys want to try to figure out like Thanksgiving, Christmas is coming up. Like what's oh, going yeah. to track? Yeah, so, keep us in check. Yeah, yeah. This is my fear. So <laughs> it's going to unravel from here on. I ate chocolate cake for dinner last night. Um, but that's okay. Oh, so, so I have like two big things, I guess I could say. Um, for supplement wise, um, a lot of people haven't heard of it, but L-carnitine and CLA mm -hmm. is like the heard of the first things. one, but I yeah, haven't heard I of the know. second. So it's like the best things you can take, and especially if you partner it with a fat burner, it's going to be like mm -hmm. so effective. But l and CLA basically target the really hard to lose fat areas. So can you just they take supplements, or can you, no, like, you have to work no, on lazy like you can't, side? You can't like eat a whole chocolate cake and then take that and like, oh, just be man. like, oh, are you okay? Yeah, that, but, that means you have to, that's like a laxative. You have to like take a laxative. <laughs> Otherwise, like, it's not going to work. At least with those, they're really going to help you if you're like trying to lose weight, especially mm -hmm. the stubborn areas that are okay. really hard. That's going to help like focus in on that. What, but, what's, the science, like, what's the science behind it? Do you know like why does it help? It just like it basically just targets those areas. So okay. a lot of things that you take, like you can't exercise and target like your fat, fat you areas. Can't fat yeah, reduce, spot reduce but or something. This will kind of like help to get those areas that are okay. a little bit harder. What about a workout regimen? What would you say? Should you do sprints? Like I've heard that the new thing is you just gotta do intervals. Yeah, interval well, training. Is fasted it. cardio is like uh -huh. the best thing you can do. Like right when you wake up, don't eat anything and just go and do. I like doing 20 minutes of sprints. So it's 30 seconds on the treadmill mm -hmm. and then you like pop your feet off and do 30 seconds. But if you don't eat anything, yeah. I feel like I'll black out. You yeah. think that, trust me. There's been times where like, I feel like you're gonna die, but you make it through, it's only 20 minutes. It's can you have bad. coffee? Yeah, you can have coffee. That actually helps with the fat burning. Oh, okay, good. Yeah. Okay, I can do that. As long yeah. as I can have my coffee, yeah. I'm okay. But the big thing, okay, this is like the game changer, and I've told this to everybody. If you are gonna eat bad, the biggest thing is you can't beat yourself up about it afterwards because then mm -hmm. you release cortisol which helps contain fat mm. because you're stressing out it's a vicious oh. cycle yeah That's so i so always tell people if you're going to eat bad you literally have to just feel good about it after because Live you a little. Eat twice as much it's true <laughs> I, yeah. I feel really good about the cake i ate last yeah time. like i was like i needed this my body wanted it i yeah. got it Come no on. but if you do that i swear you can wake up skinnier so i'm not saying you can eat a whole chocolate cake every night and go to bed like yeah that, but literally because if you're releasing good hormones like, yeah exactly okay. yeah. You're not going to be getting those stress hormones that are going to literally contain everything that you just ate. It's going to hold on to it. Okay. You yeah. can do that. Yeah. I think, I think we can manage it. We, we both feel it. better about yeah, it. Now. Exactly. Thank, thank you. <laughs> Pamela, thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. Always a pleasure. Thank and you. Um, we'll be looking out for all the merch coming out soon in the next couple days. I'm really excited about it. Awesome. Check it out.